are back, guys. And I am still admiring the beautiful view of the castle. Ah, it looks so good. Even though my guys, uh, Seymour is getting a little bored. Look at him leaning on that left, uh, right hip. But I think if you look closely, it kind of looks like uh, things are passing in front of the windows too. Okay. So last time we talked about our next task of events. And I think what we're gonna do is come back here, loot the chests. Uh, there's a couple of side missions here. We'll hit those up. Then we'll head back to the cross wands, maybe fight some enemies and head up over to Hogs. So with that, let's get to it. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I want a castle, guys. Okay. That's enough of my ring. Back here. Let's see if that's what. It's clearly a chest. Revelio. Where is that? Here. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Yeah, me neither. Wonder who lives here. Yeah, me too. Wish I could unlock it. Is that where all the chests are? They're all probably broken in. Oh, this one's open. Oh, don't, oh, don't mind me. Just stealing your shit. Go back to sleep. I feel like there's something I gotta do with these. Because it glows every time I walk by. Yeah. Incendio. Levioso. Oh, that makes a noise. Join your tea, ma'am. Ting. She looks at me like a stop that shit. See, there you go. Chest. Rebellion. I think there's a chest yet inside. This one's locked. So, random. What do you have to sell? Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. At one I'm Joel Samey, and this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. Uh... Can you tell me a bit about yourself? Oh, let's see. Well, I am Lord Hogsfield's preeminent potioneer. But I was once a lowly Hogwarts student like you. Lowly. In fact, lowly. I'll give lowly. you the Hogwarts discount. <laughs> it's the standard price. My price is low enough already, you see. Okay. Any whispers going about the town? A goblin called Pergit is causing a bit of a stink. His gang is attacking traveling vendors, and now business is suffering everywhere. Uh, it would be nice if someone would do something about it. No one wants to pick a fight with a band of goblins, though. 
Which means he's free to do what he wants down in Coral Ruins. Okay. What do you have for sale? Anything good? What can I help you with today? Spawn him in, let me run. Well, tourists, flies, we got all that stuff. Yeah, crap, dude. Oh, crap. I hope to see you again sometime. Probably not. Okay, what do you got? I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would Hard. go this far. Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ramrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. Mm. It's fucked up. Has Ranrock's lot ever attacked you like this before? Oh, they've been taunting and threatening me for a while now. But they've always believed that violence is the only way to get what they want. Things have taken a much darker turn of late. Ramrock is getting more powerful, and his loyalists know it. They feel untouchable. Ramrock assumed that all goblins would agree to follow him, but he was wrong. Many of us would like a diplomatic end to the discord with wizard kind. Good for you, Arn. Standing up for what you believe in. Principles. Man of honor. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your cards. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. Hmm. It was nice meeting you. <laughs> I wish it had been under better circumstances. Okay, yeah. Let's just run into the forest in the middle of the After night. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Right? Yeah, let's fuck some things up. What is the red over here? Enemies. Oh, it's a spider. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Incendio. Crap, gotta get a little closer to that. Even the forest looks so good, man. Oh, Moon stuff, moonstone, but I don't know what I'm doing with or what to do with it yet. Doesn't matter. Keep collecting. Uh. Revelio. Random bag. Okay. Yeah, what is this? Popped up. He's welcome. Large dragon that can grow to over nine meters in length. Large rough scale, reasonably going. This is one of the best positions that Archie could use. Hmm. Hmm. This is his hideout. Can I steal some stuff? No? Rebellion. Yeah. We going. Random bags on the side of the road. Who leaves gold bags just on the side of the trail? So, uh, what are these? Spiders? Incendio. Right. Spider bang. What the fuck was that? Want 
to drop frames is what that was. That must resist searching over there. Oh, past the ruins. Oh. I'm on the right track. Accio! Get destroyed. I'm way out here and I feel like I hear people talking. Like, is that the background noise? Because there really shouldn't be anybody talking out here, right? It should be. Uh, straight. Okay. You know what I realized? I don't, I don't even know how to crouch. Can I crouch? Or is this the only way to crouch? An encampment. This must be it. Hmm. Well, I wouldn't give for a cup of mushroom tea. If they come after me, they'll rest in ten graves. Oh shit! That's my uh, power. Nope. Yeah, these fuckers are strong, man. Shit, they get a lot of buses, man. Protego! Too late for you to learn the error of your ways. You tell him, Seymour. Yeah, I just uh, moved all your shit, too. Okay, free the cards. Can I sneakity sneak on people? Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. Hmm. Maybe I do this. This. Boom! What is up? How many of you are there? Okay. Let's see. So maybe I'll drag this dude to me. Fuck you, shit up. Spells glance off of me. Shit. Shit. Ah, uh, see, there you go. Professor Hackett's shit. My goodness. Get off. That was meant for me. Incendio. Bye, bitch. Revelio. Oh, little moon calf. No, no intruders. What do you have in store for me this time? Oh, shit. <laughs> Stop me. Levioso. Ah, 
Fuck. You can't stop us. Love you, sir. Much too slow. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Potion. Is this as a lot? Sit down. Beautiful. Ooh. Is that the best you can Fuck. do? That was so weird. Fuck. I shall avenge your death. When are you going to give up? No. Incendio. Yeah, that was embarrassing. It's a Merlin's trap. Aha! There you are. Could it be? Dude. You won't survive this, my young friend. Die, that bitch. was quite something. Now to free Arn's cart. Got to collect some balls somewhere. And more balls. Revelio. There's the balls. Akio. Follow me, balls. Right here. There you go. Enchantment. The carts are returning to arm. That's cool. Wish I could have that in the airport and just have my suitcase follow me all over the place. Nice. Oh, and there's balls. Over here, follow me, my petits. Another one? 
Revelio. What did I miss? Rebellion. Hmm. Only sell the two. Swords would be so sharp. Oh, is it out there? Is it the blue? Excuse the blue. Oh, come on. Okay. Revelio. There it is. Okay, here's another one. There's balls. There's the boss. Uh, trying to hide from me. Akio. Levioso. Akio. Incendio. Uh -huh. There we go. Akio. Follow me, follow me, follow me. Get up here. There you go. Merlin Charles won't get the best of me. It's a very pretty gazebo, so I'm decorating. Totally. Yeah, we got everyone here. So let's head back to Arn. Is that a key? So much more athletic in my uh, my sweater than in my my robe. What's the move? Oh, it's another trial. Okay, let's see if we can oh, do it. Here's a pleasant surprise. Probably something to do with these balls. Definitely something to do with balls. Akio. Okay. Move it, go. Akio. Rebellion. After all, Merlin. More gazebos. Cave down there. Man, this is an explorer's dream. Those cows? Like 
Cows. I have my beef for my burgers. Incendio. Yes. Oh, my steak. Anyway. Sorry. Got excited. That's what I learned Incendio for. Get your carts back. Where'd they go? On, I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. Apparently they're oh, slow as hell. I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good in wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. Mm -hmm. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. Oh, good. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps mm -hmm. my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. Sounds good. What a nice idea, Ron. I wish you luck with it. I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. Nice. All the best to you. One time. Okay, so there's a side quest here. So we can knock this one out of the way. For some assistance. Oh sure. What up, girl? Hello, can I help you? Oh, thank goodness, yes. My name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath, Pinch Smedley's? Name? I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's what is wishes the water and would out there? never have forgiven Just myself. Love? You see, I what need to that? retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? I don't know, it depends on if that thing is, uh, that tadpole swimming is dangerous or not. Uh, okay, sure. Diving yeah. into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid! Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help retrieving? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so dun, sorry. Dun, dun. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were There's probably that tadpole drowned. swimming around. Father was so distraught their boat. that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. Hmm. What exactly is an astrolabe? It's an astonishing ancient navigational tool. Essentially, a handheld model of the universe. Obviously, it's didn't do too well for your the stars, Astronomical pursuits. But it has nearly a thousand uses. Fascinating device. Sadly, I'd imagine it's rusted beyond repair now. Still, we'd love to have Obviously it. Obviously not good for navigating the waters. Would you like getting a bit of my grandparents back? Yeah, who are you? You seem to think I might have heard of the Bath Pinch Smedleys. Why would I know your family? That's like asking why the sky is blue or grass is green. The Pinch Please. Smedley name is synonymous with intellectual curiosity. Please. We are known for our contributions to science and art. I'm surprised you haven't heard of us, frankly. But with all no. I plan to discover about the world around us, those that don't yet know the name certainly one day will. You're, uh, quite sure of yourself there. Hmm, it sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand. But I'd be forever grateful. 
Of course, you may discover much more than the astrolabe. Anything else you found would be all yours. Mm, I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. No, oh, right next to that it little tadpole. It would be tadpole, wonderful huh? to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. I do hope See? to find the astrolabe. He's red. It would he mean is so evil. much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. Yeah. See, she wants me to get eaten by that thing. What's up? So I'm gonna go right after it and see. Oh, I can't do anything. <gasps> I can't do anything in the water. Okay, so we run away. Okay. Oh, I can't. Yeah, bitch, I can hit you from here. Bring you in closer. Uh, or not. No, I can't. Let me and so. Levioso, your ass? Nope. That's right. I'll just snipe you guys from out here. Snipe, 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 snipe. Ta! Doug Logs. See, I knew that thing was evil. That's probably what sunk your ship, man. There's a shiny thing here, though. I assume that's something, right? Ah, okay. Northeast of here. Gosh, I'm so far out here. I can take it like a, a canoe or something and die from the canoe. This must be where the Pink Smedley family astrolabe is. I know they're saying like Astrolab, but I feel like it sounds like they're saying Astrolab. Oh, first try! Look at that. <laughs> nice. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. That was that was fast. That was a lucky guess. Shit. It's all right. So die for the other stuff. Sleek sorcerer's hat. All right. Dragonite spectacles. Okay, nothing else. Alright. Okay. Oh, shit. Right there. Oh no! Not my gear slots. Oh, is that the uh, bog, duck bog, tadpole thing? Yeah. 90, 60, 90. Whatever, let me just try this. I guess I did collect all kinds of stuff, right? 26, 4, 34, nice, 30, 31, 34, pretty winkle. 
Oh. Looking dapper. I wish it was green to match my other stuff. Oh, this one. The long coat. Okay, this one here. Uh, we'll destroy this one. Get rid of that one. Okay, we got a couple of slots open now. Might get on the best. Thirty. Kind of liking the sweater better. This isn't bad though. Uh, two, three, three, two. Okay, let's try this one. I feel like I'm gonna find plenty of stuff, so I don't really care about selling everything. This is, these are legendaries, but they're not as good as these ones are. Oh, because they're in the 15 level. It's 25. 7, you can't upgrade. 26, you can't though. Don't like those. So with those, I've got two twenty sevens. I don't know how to apply traits or anything like that, so I thought we would just get rid of this one as well. For that, some new hilts. That's pretty cool. Kind of goes with my. Vine action. Nah, it's too gaudy. I like that. Okay, so first, um, get rid of these glasses. Stupid. Um, the coat. I just wish it was green. So I'd go with my other stuff. Yeah, I kind of like running around without it better. I don't know. I feel sleeker. I feel more agile. Same with this one, it's better, but I kind of like the green sweater, I was digging that. What's this? What the fuck is that? Yo! Completely be on an adventure. Those boots. The little leg sling there. like a pirate though. I'm gonna go back to this. Yeah, I kind of like that with the green gloves that I have on. Yeah. Did I get any cloaks? I just have the one. Okay. Yeah, let's go with that. Okay. So chair again. Dragon Eye Spectacles. And a blue nightcap. Ugh. Such a long swim. 
I don't know how much I want to give this back to you now. Can I just run? Run around. Stop waiting. We got a wedgie. And castle. Hmm. Okay. I trust you didn't find the dive too terribly difficult. It was terrible. Absolutely terrible. I had to kill Hello, Grace. The I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible. Did you find the astrolabe? I did, and I'm keeping it. <laughs> I feel like she's not going to give me much of anything anyways. Right? So, whatever. I did. I hope it makes your father happy. It will. I can't wait to see his face. Thank you so much for doing this for me. And for my family. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Yep, already did. Thank you again. And I do hope you keep diving. You certainly have a knack for finding treasure. Nice. Okay, so... Accomplish what we are going for. It looks like there's another Merlin's quest. Here. So, there's one here, there's one here. Then I can do the cross wands. There. There, pretty close. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. I know a Merlin trial when I see one. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Bedazzle. Yeah. One down there, there was one there. There's one here. So Akio. Stacked set of balls. Here, here, here. Oh, take your time. That's that. Settle. Boom. Easy. Easy. It's construction. Constructing gazebos. That's all Merlin was trying to do. He just wanted to uh, have places to sit, drink his tea, smoke a pipe. Okay, let's go with this one. Yeah, see, I hear people talking. As if I'm inside or something. Did I pass? Yeah, here's this one down here too. This uh, this cave, which I don't know how to uh. fix. But did I see something? Yeah, see, there's vines here. Is it tied to this one then? Has to be, right? you have in store for me this time. Yeah, I saw a ball. I assume I'm gonna roll it down to that hole. Yeah. 
Ball. Balls and holes. Incendio. No, wrong direction. That's your home. Don't you want to go to your home? Get in there. Get in there. All the way down. All the way down. Yes. No! No, 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 no. No, stop. Too much, too much pace on it. Oh, come on. Get in there. That's your home. There we go. Balls and holes. And more gazebo action. Okay. Now where are we going? So I want to do the... Oh shit, I guess still gotta burn some people. Okay, let's go to the cross ones. Out some faces with my my incendio. Ready to get their asses handed to them. Uh, let's practice with the dummy first. Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? You see that dude's robe behind me? Yo, wh why you got it tucked into your pants like that, dude? That's not how that's supposed to go. <laughs> I think you're supposed to leave that out after using the bathroom. That'd be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. Uh, Alright, so what am I doing? I'm doing... Bam. Incendio. Bam. Levioso. Bam. Nicely done. Okay, so then. Bam. One, two, three. Akio. Incendio. Burn. Okay. Here, hit. Barney face. One, two, three. Levioso. One, two, three. Get over here. Get, ah, get over here. Yes. One, two, three, four. Excellent fall. Almost missed it on that last one. Jeez. Impressive wand work. I'd hate to face you in a duel. Thanks, Lucan. You've been a great help. Oh, stop. Don't make me blush. Seriously, well done. Training dummies will think twice before challenging you again. Plus, you'll be even more formidable <laughs> than crossed ones. Other duelists had better beware. 
A beware. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of cross wands ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. Ready for a shot at glory? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Yes. Uh, homegirl, Natty. Yes, Natty. Then let's get started. We can make this a real victory. Shut up. Spirit. Four of them? Against two? Okay, red is fire. Nope. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Messing things up. Shit. God dang. Get off me. There goes my way. Levioso. Levioso. Find the one. No, 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 no. Fuck. I got discombobulated. I got. Oh, they really oh for muffled. Out of you that round. Care to try again? Yes. I'm messing my, yes, I'm my, ready my now. buttons up. Very well. Good luck out there. Okay. So. Incendio. Levioso. Die, bitch. Levioso. Levioso. That's right, bitch. Okay. Incendio. Bye, bitch. Four against two. Thank you very much. Victory! You've won the tournament. I hope so. I'm just pleased to have done as well as I did. And we're pleased to have such a gracious champion. Now to the victor goes the prize. And so it is my great honor to present you with this simple yet elegant token of supreme oh, jewelry accomplishment. Uh, thank you. Thank you. It's been an honor. You earned it. You are a jewelist to be reckoned with. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Nah. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. They're probably dead. Championship garb. Yeah. Yeah. Lost Sorry. to a new student. I didn't see that coming. Hmm. Shame it's over. I was just getting started. Whatever. Okay, so what do I get here? Morning Legendary C2, C34. Six. 
Okay. Um, quests. Ah, let's go learn real quick. And then I can go meet what's his face in Hogsmeade. Was a classroom. Somewhere here. Where am I going? Is it? Yes. <laughs> so much learning, so much quill writing. They are not having as much fun as they're making look out to me. All right, what you got for me? I hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. I did. I rolled around. I completed all of the some spiders. Assignments. Burned well, some the faces. Time. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Oh. Almost messed up. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Yes, this dummy won't know what hit him. Where is it? There. Okay. Expelliarmus. You seem to have the right end of the stick. That's but keep all. practicing. Levio Expelliarmus. Incendio. Your life. Burn your face. Accio. So we do, we do a little Levioso, and then we disarm you, and then we hit, 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 and pull you back. Accio. And then burn your face off. Boom. Okay. Hogs me. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna run that this time, even though that is tempting to go by the Merlin trial. Let's go to Hogs me. Floof here. See what this dude wants. Because they all want my attention. They all need my assistance. They all need my help. They're like, oh, Seymour, Seymour, please, please help me. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Rebellion. No teens, that's what I like to hear. It's far away, I don't know where it's at. It's so dusty in here. Good of you to come. My friend, Professor Elevanda. Fink, speaks highly of you and your resourcefulness. He was vague as to details, but mentioned your having tracked down a difficult-to-find book. I wondered if you'd be willing to do a little detective work on my behalf. 
Well, quite possibly. I have to let you know, Mr. Ollivander, uh, since our first meeting, I have better uh, performance and not experiencing those, uh, you know, early mishaps when I first got my wand. Fireworks on uh, touching and uh, explosions thereafter, you know, I'm doing, I'm doing very well with myself, sir. How about you, you know? Anyways. Sounds intriguing. Of course, Mr. Ollivander. Sounds most up my street. Wonderful. You see, about a century ago, an heirloom applewood wand with a fairy wing core went missing from this very shop. My great aunt suspected a student named Richard Jackdaw. He'd been serving as an assistant here and suddenly vanished. Richard Jackdaw? Like the bird. In fact, he was known to frequent the Hogwarts Owlry. We searched there, of course, but found no wand. We did find a series of statues similar to Jackdaws. I'm certain they're a clue, but I cannot figure out where they lead. Jackdaw was last heard tittering about some pages with a map he'd stolen from Peeves. As you can imagine, the poltergeist was less than helpful. Yeah, because that dude's a douche. Peeves. Um, why that Is one? there anything special about the wand? Oh, yes. It's terribly special. But not in the way you might think. It won't grant special powers to the caster, no. Nothing like that. But it will ease the hearts and minds of the Ollivanders to know of its return. And that power is immeasurable. That's a lame answer. Way to, way to dodge the question, sir. Why would the thief have taken the wand? I must admit I have no idea. From what I can gather, he fancied himself an adventurer of sorts. Always looking for trouble. In fact, after he went missing, rumor had it his ghost was seen in Hogsmeade. Never heard much about him after that, but it seems as if his adventurous spirit may have got the better of him. Perhaps he thought that the wand had some special power simply because of its esteemed lineage. Astonishing how misunderstood the art of wand making is. I feel like he's not telling you something. Surely you could continue searching the Owlery? Oh, one would think. However, the Headmaster does not take kindly to an old wand maker loitering about the place. Can't say I blame him. Also, I have perhaps been looking for too long. I feel a fresh set of eyes, and a bright mind like yours is sure to solve this riddle. I'll have a look for you. You've certainly given me plenty to go on. Oh, you've brought hope to this old wand maker's heart. Professor Fig was right. You are a remarkable student. Mm, well, I haven't done anything yet, so... Mm. Let's not be too hasty. Alright, I'm gonna go in here. Follow the owl, right? Revelio. Oh, is it back at the school? It's gotta be back at the school, right? Wrong one. Uh, oh, yes. Have I just not seen that tower on this map before? I feel like it just now appeared here. There. There's a side mission here, but I'm going to finish this one before I start any of these side missions. Floof over here that I saw on the map, so I'm gonna get the flu. Okay. 
Revelio. That's a side mission. There's the flu. Okay. I might see another flu on here too. Whoa. Yeah, it'll be right in my path. Get up to the back. Eh. 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 There we go. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Who is yelling? Is yelling. Jeez. My oh, goodness. Revelio. We are somewhere around here, right? Nothing? No loots? I feel like the voice acting in this game is really good as well. Like it doesn't sound overly cheesy. I mean, some of the dialogue is a little cheesy, but it's not off-putting. You know what I mean? Like sometimes the dialogue just feels like it doesn't fit the theme of the game sometimes, or um, it's just awkward. But they did a nice job, and the uh, the voice acting is one. Revelio. <laughs> What's going on? I really wish I knew what these green stones are for. Going on adventure. Going to the hour, hour, hourly, hourly. Hourly? Back. The statues Mr. Ollivander mentioned must be upstairs amongst the owls. What kind of owl would you like? I kind of wish I had a, like an actual owl as a pet. It'd be pretty cool. I don't know what it's like to take care of them. Don't mind me, Owls. I'm just here to help a friend. Now, where are those statues? Revelio. I recognize those handles. The song. There he is. A kinds of them. All right, so you just start grabbing them. Accio. I'd best keep looking. I'll Oops. take that, thank you. Yes, please. It's probably not going to be the foot. What is that? Statue? Is that what I was looking for? Nothing. Statue? Akio! Here's a welcome surprise. Money, money, money. No statues here. Birds aren't afraid of heights. Perhaps I should look a bit higher. Perhaps. Sounds like a good idea, Seymour. This'll do nicely. Akio. I'd best keep looking. <laughs> Nothing. Hmm. No statues here. 
Levioso. Two. No! Hello, Alan. Accio. Revelio. Accio. My best keep looking. <laughs> Nothing. So many. No statues here. Eh. I'll take that, thank you. Yeah, I would if I could grab it. I'd best keep looking. Here's a welcome surprise. There's a ghost up there. Like the stuff that I slide on. Click all this stuff. Ah, dude, get off. Revelio. Purchase could be the right size for jackdaws. Oh, or statues of jackdaws. What's happening? Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh, that's how you get up there. <laughs> Creepy. Yep, I'd have the same <laughs> expression, <it> Seymour. <laughs> Has someone solved my puzzle after all these years? Well done indeed. Good news. If you've got something to hide, you found the perfect spot. Richard Jackdaw, at your service. The Richard Jackdaw. So Mr. Ollivander was right. He wants his family wand back. Goodness. I'd forgotten about that wand. <laughs> I assure you, I don't have it on me. I'm almost certain I dropped it the moment I was beheaded in that cave. Uh. Oh, it was sheer folly to follow that map. What map? Ridiculous, really. Found it on some yellowed old pages Peeves had pilfered. Thought I could impress a girl. But that's a story for another day. So, you stole a wand and then followed a map on some pages that you took from Peeves and followed that map to your doom. Odd to hear it all reduced to such absurdity, <laughs> but yes. Why do you care about small Was the girl wand? impressed? I don't really. Least? Ollivander does. It's the pages I'm after. Might they be with the wand in the cave? Indeed. Say, here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest? I'd be happy to show you where to find them. Hmm. Yeah, how do you lose your head? I think I can guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look about when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze, after which I felt, well, light-headed. <laughs> That's all I remember. Hence, mm. if you do visit the cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Mm. Beware a light breeze. Which is a trap. Some Indiana Jones traps. Why would you steal Mr. Ollivander's family wand? The family were always going on about how special it was, so I took it. Who could resist? Sadly, <laughs> it wasn't special enough to save my neck. I fully intended to return it once I learned it was only special for sentimental reasons. But as you can see, I never got the chance. Hmm. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He's got a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor, whatever's likely to cause the most chaos. 
I doubt he even noticed they were gone. Here you go. If that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you there. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, the wand and the pages are yours for the taking. Hmm. Okay. This dude just appeared up here. Checking out the owls too. Is there a side quest up there? Is just somebody standing up there? So that looks like the Forbidden Forest, right? And then there's the bridge. So light the candles. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Hmm. Or I could just jump. Where's a broom when you need it? Up, dude. Can I floop out of here, actually? I'm gonna run all the way across that. Yeah, so I did that and get a floop there. I think right next to the entrance. How oh, nice to see you, my young friend. And then that's the stone bridge. Right? Yes, that's forbidden. This is the bridge. My dearest Apollonia, would you care to join me for a picnic? I know you enjoy a good Cornish pasty almost as much as you enjoy a good mystery. See you soon. I hope yours, Richard. <laughs> it says candles. Incendio. Or some shit. No. Gotta light that up, maybe. That's like way off, right? I'm not even hitting that. Off on another adventure, are we? How do I put those pages again? Lumos. What, what am I doing here?
Bye. Salut. That looks like Lumos. Candles. So there's the floof, that's Hogsmeade. Bitten Forest. It would be that bridge there, but it's not there. It's too far away, right? Lumos. Oh, giant <laughs> candles. Wonder where they're heading. Candles, follow the candles. I'm a boss. The candles seem to be leading into the forbidden forest. Yeah, forbidden. You know, give. No fucks were given. About the signs, about the warnings, nothing. Shit, where they go? Oh, right there. Jeez. I was looking at the chickens and I forgot what I was doing. Zoom in. The treasure must be nearby. I suppose a picnic in the Forbidden oh. Forest could seem romantic. Treasure hunting suits me. Yeah, it does. How sweet. Will they never make it? Did they die before they got here? Okay. Uh, let's go meet what's his face. Jump! Ow. As good as my word. Good. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. Only a Ravenclaw would travel this far in pursuit of knowledge. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. <laughs> Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, <laughs> I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Yes, we shall. Where are we going? Aside from the bird oh. bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm. Now look. Oh, floof. <laughs> nice. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Hmm. Is that Latin? Or Greek. Hmm. This looks dangerous. Danger, danger. Very, very dangerous indeed. 
Okay. I think this is where we're going to end it, guys, because I feel like this might be a big cave. And judging by the spider webs, there's going to be a lot of freaking spiders in here. And we're going to have to fight our way through and out. So we'll pick it up in the next video. Um, I'm excited to find out what that is the end of this little adventure here. I feel like he got his head chopped off from a, uh, a trap of some sort. But um, we'll give it a go in the next video. See what we can do for now. Have a good night, guys. Have a good day. Take it easy. Drop a like. Drop a comment. We'll see you next time. See ya.